All right. If you hadn't watched part one, you better go watch it first and then watch this one. This little small spot from the concrete to the sidewalk, I dug there for about three hours. Might've been longer. I pulled up so many coins from around the bushes, just this little tiny spot. I got a bucket lister right there in that bush on the right next to the steps. And over here, I dug for two days after work. That was about an hour and a half each. And I pulled up a bunch of silver and I pulled up one that I can't tell you what it is. I think it's a, a it is silver. And oh, it's, it's, a, it's unreal what this yard just put out in this, these two little spots. And I went back over it and I found four more coins. I did the whole yard. So y'all check it out. Great yard. Hey, I got some help. My daughter, say hi, Annabelle. Hi. And uh, hit it on there, see if I got it. Okay. All right, I got it in my hand. Hit it my hand. Oh, it's in my hand. I see it. What is it? Right here. We got a coin? Oh, might want to put it up there where you can see it. Okay, I got a, nope, it's not a coin. I got a button. <laughs> Okay, I don't think it's an old button. It's missing the top part. But we got something. It rang up like a, like a uh, nickel, 13. All right, let's see what else we can get. You wanna do the magic? Hold on. Come on, we, we're, filming a, on. we're filming a show here. We've got a penny in this pile. Hold on, you do it. <laughs> no, I want you to do it, because this will be the first one we keep. It looks like a wheat penny. Wheat. All right, Annabelle, you found your first wheat penny. Look here. Wheat. <laughs> we got a wheat penny. Let me see what the date is. Hang on just a second. I screwed with this one for a good while. I can't see the date on here. You know, I thought it was a 45. I thought it was a 39. I'm not really sure, so we're going to go next. Yep, another penny. Ooh. All right, we are racking it up, and we're still in the same hole. Don't don't be beeping that. Because it'll be beeping all over the camera. Let's see here. Looks like another wheat. It's hard to read. Another wheat. All right, let's see if I can get a date on it. It might be like the other one. this thing about 100 times. It's like the other one. I can't tell the date, but I got a wheat penny, so that's wheat penny number two. All right, this is the third day. Grab a hold of the thing, honey. There we go. There we go. Let's see if we can another, find it. Another penny. Right here. It's keep, right here. Keep, keep poking it. Keep holding it. It's right there. Here we go. I got it. I got it. Ooh, it's another thing about you. All right, another wheat penny. I hope you guys were on that because I could not see nothing. The sun's very bright. I got a wheat penny. Did you if, it, it if, it's, if it's like the other ones, it's going to be hard to see the date. I'm going to try to get it, but if not, I'll give it to you in, in the video. All right, Annabelle. All right, I think we got it right there. Let's see what we can find out what it is. This is metal detecting with Annabelle today. You guys are just getting lucky to come along. And it looks like penny day. I want to see it. Oh, God. Yeah, thank you. Move it away from all the metal. I just can't like this. I'm having a hard time seeing the wheat. Yeah, it's a wheat penny. I'll give you guys all the dates at the end. Okay. They're, they're, they're hard to see. All right. Sorry, sorry, sorry. <laughs> okay. Got another wheat penny. I'm going to have a bunch of wheat pennies when this is over. All 
I cannot see the date again. It looks like a 26. I got this one. 1926. Didn't even have to do anything to it. All right, next. Got another corn. Looks like another penny. Let's hope it's a wheat. I was just making sure it's on. Yep, another wheat penny. This one looks in pretty good shape. At least the wheat side does. I might be able to get a date off this one. Give me a it's second. It's a 1946. All right, I found something. It's not a penny, but it rang up like a penny. It's got a little gun, got a lot of writing on it. There is a number. You know, this could be like a policeman's something. I don't know what it is. And, oh yeah, it's gotta be, cause it's got like innocent watching clue. It might be part of a game. I'm not sure what it is. This, this gun probably spins. It's got a number up here, so. Tom Mix is the name on on this little thing. This this is a cool little find. This is probably something to do with his retirement. And this spins around. It says clue. Be careful. No, I'm not sure what this is, but hey, man, I like it. That's gonna be one of my keepers. Alrighty. You don't know? Mm -mm. It's another penny. Wheat penny. He's a wheat penny. Yeah, wheat penny. It is a wheat penny. <laughs> 44, 1944. All right, looks like wheat penny day. You go, girl. I think it's somewhere in the hole. All right, let me see that stick. Right there. I went. Got it out of the hole. Another wheat penny. This one's in good shape. You can read the one cent on there really well. The front. 1936. These are pretty good shape. Pretty good shape wheat pennies. All right, next. Looks like another penny. Okay, that's wheat penny number six. This is I think I'll be able to read All this. Right. It looks like a 1937, but it's not a 100% sure on that. I couldn't get all the muck off. That's my little helper. She got hot and tired on a 60, 70 degree day. And uh, back to the wheat pennies. I think this is number seven. All right, I'm gonna have to get you the dates on these. There's a lot of cleaning to do. Alrighty, we pee, we penny number seven. Yeah. Another wee penny. I think this is number eight. I might have lost count. Again, this is my best yard. I might have to divide this video into two parts. between my fingers look what slipped between my fingers when i'm i'm digging in this hole you can't see it for the shadow you know this uh i'm digging in that hole and that slipped between my fingers i don't even know what it is it could be a rosy nope another mercury that makes number four for this yard 1944 all righty 
pretty good shape. I figured it'd be a rosy, but I got a Merc. Beautiful. So I've been finding nothing but pennies in the front of the house, so it was ringing up at 25, 26. I just thought I had a silver. Alrighty. Ring up like a nickel, and it is a nickel. And it is a war nickel. That's my second one. 1943. Beautiful. Take them all day long. I think when I get done with this yard, I'm going to go back over it. Looking like a shotgun shell. I was at the Florida Six Hunt yesterday. I think I dug about two handfuls of these suckers yesterday. Didn't find anything good. I'm not sure if I'm going to do a video because I don't think you guys want to see me digging shotgun shells. All right, 12 gauge. If you can see, I'm under this bush and I had like a quarter. Yep. Hoo, hoo, hoo. Another bucket lister. If you can see that, that is a standing or a sitting. No, that's a standing. 1930. Look at that sucker. I have not found one of these. I have found three bucket listers in this yard. This one is in great shape. I don't even think I have one of these in my collection. Wow, that is a awesome coin. It was ringing up like a quarter. I was just thinking, hey, I might have a silver quarter. But I didn't think it was going to be this. That is awesome. So I've got this. I've got a buffalo. And what was the other one? I can't remember what the other one was. Well, anyway, I'll remember it when I see the video. I got him right here somewhere. Ah, let me flip around in the sun. I hope you can see. Yeah, it's just a wee penny. Some of these wheat pennies have been in pretty good shape. They're just very dirty. I got the 19, I can see. 1942. All right, there's a lot of 40s in this yard. All right, next. All right, I'm digging up under some trees and it looks like we got an old nickel. I hope you can see this. I might have to spray it off. I can't see the date. Give me a second, I'm gonna spray it off. It's kinda in rough shape. Maybe you can see I'm in some trees right now on my knees. 1942. That is my third war nickel out of this yard. That's just unheard of. All right, next. Right underneath these trees again. Just on the inside. And this sucker looks slick. Let me get rid of this dirt. That is a slick coin. I haven't had one that slick. All right. I can't tell what it is. Hope you're seeing that. Let me spray it off, see if I can get anything. Let's just do it live, heck. It is slick. There ain't nothing on there. All right, let me see if I can get something. Just hang on a second. Man, I'll be right. kind of disappointed. This thing is so slick. I have sprayed and sprayed. 
looks like a penny. I start seeing stuff in there and then it looks like something else. So if anybody sees anything, yeah, I'm going to go home and clean it, but it is so slick. Thought for a sec, it's very thin and it's not a dime. I'm not seeing the little ripples on the side. But if anybody's got an idea, let me know. I'll get a picture of it where you can see it front, back, all that stuff. All right, we're going to go next. I-25, 26 is bouncing all over the place. Looks like another Mercury. No, it don't. What the heck is that? I have no idea. It looks like another coin. It's got a one on it. It's Oh, no, it is a Mercury. It was upside down. So let me get, let me get a date. It was just looking weird. I don't know why. All right, let me see get a date. First silver that's come out of the ground. It's been all ugly color, but I got a 1923 Mercury. It's really hard to see. All right, next. All right, finally. See if we got a nickel in here. We got something. Looks like an old button. You guys that are good on buttons, y'all let me know. I don't know what it came off of. I'll see if there's any writing on it later. But, got a button. Tons of roots. I can't even get my finger in there and I accidentally pulled this out. I don't even know what it is yet. I see a one dime and I know what it is. I got a barber. My gosh, this yard. A barber dime. Whew. I don't, I mean, I, I can't believe how many coins I'm finding. I mean, look at that sucker. I didn't even got a date yet. I just pulled it out and threw it right on the ground there. And I didn't even know I pulled it out. I don't know All if you right. can see that, but I got an 1898 or a 96. It looks like an eight. All right. There was, there's an old, there's a, there was an old school to the north of me. And I want to see if they'll let me do their the city hall where it is now and this may have a little bit to do with it because i'm right on the edge of city hall city hall is right through them trees so i mean my gosh i got a barber out of this yard that might be what that other one is i can't see it because this one's pretty slick too so i might actually have two barbers when i get home get to looking at it it might show up where i can see i can compare the two and go from there but I cannot believe I found a barber dime here. All right, see what else we can get. Another day. All right, what we got here? I got another one. I can't see what it is. Let me spray it for a second. Nope. I got a Lincoln. Let's get a little spray on it. I'm sure it's a wheat penny. Yeah. Wheat penny. Wonderful wheat penny. Five twenty-six. Possible silver. Look at all these roots. They're everywhere. Let's we'll see what we find. Annabelle, this is going to be your first silver, possibly. I'm seeing... It's off, honey. You ain't going to do that. I see it. <laughs> all right. Look at here. Looks like a dime. Looks like a Merc. 
It's mercury a sli dime. It, yeah, mercury dime. <laughs> it is slick. And I I had dug right right here and right there. You can see where the marks are. To find that? All right, give me a second. I'll get you a date. No, previously. All right, I got a 1917. And it is slick, slick, slick. All right, we're going to the next. I'm going back over what I just went over. You always find something. Looks like we got a rifle, rifle cartridge. All right, it's been a little bit. It is an old one. What do you think about that, Annabelle? You want it? No. Okay. I think this is going to make it home. It is so thin. Looks like a piece off some silverware. And it is paper thin. I mean, it, it ain't but about a little over an inch. And it's already cracked up the side. I'm going to see if there's any more in there. But, yeah. Pretty design. All right. I got a little coin in here. It was ringing up like a dime, and it's not a dime, it's a penny. I can't see if it's a weedy. It is. All right, I'll give you the 1944 wheat. It's kind of hard to see on the back side of it. All righty. See it. And it's another wheat penny. Let me see if I can get you a date. This side of the yard, they were all dirty. Hard to see. Give me a second. See the date. So I'll get it to you in the video. Looks like a coin here. And that's another Merc. I don't know, I've lost count. I've got two today. I'm going back wherever, all the places I've been. I've pulled up a couple weeds and a couple Mercs. Let me a get a date. Spraying. A little bit of wiping. 1943. I noticed over here in this dirt, I've got two of them, they're just colored. So, that phone call I had to wait. Alrighty, that's two marks today. Alright, hey y'all, thanks for watching my video. And I'll probably never find a yard like this again in my life. Because this was one of the best yards I've been in so far. It took 12 to get a good one, but, but I got one. Hey, I thank y'all for watching. I'll see y'all next time.